Hello Warfighters, War is Hal. Welcome to a brand new episode of Star Wars Squadrons. It's a VR dogfight battle. And this is going to be the first time I have actually flown in a TIE Fighter. Out of all the different fights that I've done on here, I've gone with just about everything. I guess I haven't done support craft either. Um, but I've done a little bit in the X-Wing. I just haven't done anything in the TIE Fighter. So I'm like, you know what, let's, let's give it a shot. As far as loadouts go, I'm just going with the default loadout. I haven't modified it at all. Just get a good feel for it. Uh, and I'm starting to think that this might be all right. It's definitely a lot more sluggish than what I'm used to flying with the TIE Interceptor. And uh, I I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll kind of see how this goes. It'll be nice. Oh, that TIE Fighter, or uh, that X-Wing, I mean, just ran right into me. Uh, it'd be nice to have mines. But that was actually one of the weapons I could not choose for this, even though that's probably my favorite loadout to go with. Now, this X-Wing decides to break his attack on me. That's all right. The one thing that I will admit, that I'm glad that I have again here, is the ability to repair my fighter while I am flying about. That's one thing I don't have when I go as a TIE bomber. Gosh, that was a quick turn by that X-Wing, but another kill assist right there. I have yet to get a kill myself, but uh, I'm at least helping out here a little bit. I got somebody who's coming at me. Another kill assist again. Uh, but this X-Wing is has got his sights. Or I thought he was going to have his sights on me, but adjusted for somebody else. Could this be the first kill? It is. Kill number one here, and then I've got an A-Wing that's flying about. Seems to be going after somebody else. And he seems to uh, fly this pretty well as he's got that maneuverability going. I'm going to fire that missile at him. There we go with kill number two. So, okay, maybe I've got the hang of it here with this TIE fighter. We'll just kind of have to wait and see. But, I mean, you look at how we're doing. We're 10-1 and one right now. We're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with this Y-Wing. It's not going to end well. Except for the fact... Yeah, somebody else was shooting at me. It was that A-Wing. And I got him down to... At least that Y-Wing. I got him down to just one bit of health. So, I should get the assist there we go three kills three assists or oh, wait no two kills Ready four assists fall. one death there we go all right looks like this is going to be an easy victory for us seeing how far we are up right now 12 to 3 remember 30 is the big number that we have to try and get to target that a wing also i think somebody else got that mine yeah knowing that they had dropped that off there i wasn't just gonna go uh, right into that. Okay, I'm going to go after this Y-Wing. Smart call dropping the mine off right there. That's going to go ahead and hit me. It's nice seeing <laughs> the strategies I'm using kind of work against me. We'll try and get a little bit of a repair in. We'll keep fighting. Oh, not too bad. I mean, that got me up into the 70s here with my whole health. Nice kill. Just going through some of this debris, getting a shot, I think, at the last second. Gosh, was that A-Wing just basically stationary? All right, X-Wing, I was worried, was going to be coming after me, but not the case. We'll get the shot off with the missile. He'll get that evaded, but I'm just coming up right behind him. He did have his shields up, and it looks like he's focused him now on what is going on behind him, which is obviously me. That's going to be the best thing for him and probably going to help keep him alive. But we've got his shields down now. It's just a matter of trying to figure out where he's going to go. I'm going to let those lasers recharge too because, yeah, he's doing a great job evading me. Uh, I was hoping that that was going to be it right there. There we go. Yeah, honestly, with, with this TIE Fighter, it's just, at least for me, just a weird medium in between what I've I've been uh, flying with previously. Oh, TIE Interceptor flies <laughs> right out in front of me. He's going to come up and around. Honestly, TIE Interceptor's probably going to get the kill. Actually, he disengages. We we'll keep trying to chase him around. He's at three. Doesn't have many shields behind him, so... Oh my gosh, this is getting really hard. Mad props for the way that he's evading. He's got his shields back up. 
We'll just we'll just disengage and go with this guy who seems to be on me again. Another time. I really wish I could have just dropped those those mines off. Oh, I'm marked by somebody, which is not good for me. There we go. We'll get in behind him and we'll get that kill. Yep, I will likely get destroyed right here since everybody was focused on me. Six whole health and how am I popping back from that? Oh my gosh. I did not think that was uh, going to be possible. Okay, I'm just gonna have to wait till I can repair it yet again. This is gonna be really tough considering how many enemies it looks like I've got near my position. Just one person needs to lock on me. Start engaging me, there it is. That might be a, an A-wing that's in, engaging me, but I got the kill. Yep, it's an A-wing. We'll come up and around. He's disabled, that might be what I need. Whoa, this is some great teamwork, honestly. 25 and six. I really don't think that this would be going this way with the TIE Fighter if I didn't have such a strong team. Yep, the way that this is going, we're just going a little bit at a time here with, with taking them out. And so really it's just one after another that's starting to get respawned while the majority of us are right here. Okay, so he got the, the heal, not too bad. He's gonna try and get out of here pretty quick. I'll be on his tail as well as some of the other members of the team. Got his front shields knocked down, but that's not gonna do me too much good since I'm gonna try to get behind him. I'll actually disengage and... Oh, never mind, someone else got the A-wing. All right, we'll, we'll get back on an X-wing here and... All right, again, front shields down, come around. I think we're kind of in a, a turning battle right here. And he's going to have the advantage. Someone else has locked on to me too. It looks like a good portion of the team is back in. Yep, that's gonna be it. Not necessarily the best life right there towards the end, but hey, you know what? We end up winning this match. I come out on top as the best player, which is pretty surprising with the fact that I'm just not familiar with the TIE Fighter, but we get the job done. Let's take a look and see how I did on the scoreboard with this 30 to nine victory. Dang, major one-sided. Yeah, I got most damage dealt. It looks like right there. All right, completed match. Just got level 18. All right. And seven kills, two deaths, eight assists, which means 15 of the kills I was in on, so half of the team's effort. Not too bad. I'll definitely take that, but... Uh, was a lot of fun going with something different. I don't know if I'll stick with the TIE Fighter. We'll have to wait and see uh, how often I'm going to want to use that. But I might try to go back to the TIE Interceptor again just to see how, how that goes. But I might have to modify some things a little bit. But obviously, A-Wing gameplay is coming down the line. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Obviously, biggest thanks to everybody at Patreon for supporting me, letting me do this. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys come back for more Star Wars Squadrons. War is hell. You don't have to worry because Warfighters, I got your six.